welcome to the Bread of Life Deliverance Ministries, a place of unrestricted praise and worship. Come go with us as we enter into the gates of Thanksgiving. Get ready, get ready. The second is the neighbor. We've been having a whole lot of revivals, and that's all we've been experiencing, revival. But we have not experienced resurrection power because if we go back to St. John chapter 11, God gotta wait till something is dead.
watch real quick. Come here, come here, Tim. This is some of y'all right now. Oh, Apostle said, increase. Open the top. This is your offering. Open the top. I'm, oh, Apostle said, increase, increase. So, <laughs> three years later, you ain't blessed yet. Right. I wonder why. The Bible said, if you have offered anybody, before you give and leave your offering, you ought to get it right with that person that you have an offering. So three people say, I wonder why you're not blessed right now. Well, I'm preaching. I'm feeling good right now. I got the sea legs. I got the land legs back now. Watch this now. This is the last one. Throw it, throw it in. Throw it down. Throw it down. This is the last one. I like this one. I like this one. I like this one. That's the last one. The big one. Look at it. Say, say la. Pause. Think. Own it. Pause. Pause. Put that there. Grab your wife's hand. Come up here. Grab your hook, your wife's hand. Come up here, little Testimony. The Lord just blessed us with a brand new house. So 
stuff to me. And not just me, I told him about, I, I ain't gonna say it, I ain't told, I, PT, the first one, where PT at? Come here. Where PT, oh, he left? PT left, watch this. Like, where, come here, PT. I told him, I said, I, 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 I wanna share something with you, but hey, see, can I say this? I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it. Say it, say it. My wife and I experience the season now, everywhere we go, it's like we gotta pay for nothing. People just, y'all good people, they don't even know who I am. You're good people. Can I buy your meal for you? Can we do this for you? Can we do that every time for the past three times we've been in the mall? We went in there to get something for her. She couldn't find what she's looking for. We walk out with something that we ain't paid for. So let me deal with all the naysayers. Like you said, the naysayers are the naysayers. When they say, the ones that they say, they the ones that's the naysayers. And come to that revelation. Some people just cannot handle the blessings of other people. But I heard it all prompt me. In December, y'all saw that man and woman of God came, came here. That Caucasian couple. Who we met on a cruise. Or some Aisha, hallelujah. We told y'all about how they blessed my wife and I with Invicta watches. Those of you that know what Invictas are, y'all know how expensive they are. This man did not know me from Adam. He said, the Lord told me to do this for you. See how I tried to get in here? Because I done heard the mindset. We tired of hearing that story. But guess what? You were here when you see it in my book. The man right now went through surgery, came out successful. He said, he said, man, my life has totally changed since I met you. Come on, somebody. I was praying, I said, God, my wife can tell you, when the man blessed me with the watch, I almost fell through the boat. <laughs> I didn't say another word. The man asked, he, he asked, I called my, my brother from another mother. Um, he asked, he said, what's wrong with preacher? He said, preacher, you deserve. I'm like, you don't understand, you don't understand. I'm humble. I was crying. I went back to my room, crying. And I began to pray, I said, God, I know there's an evicted watch that's up for that. Whoever bought a watch, it's a raffle that goes at the end of the cruise. God, I pray that they win that watch. Because the Bible said if you give to a prophet in the name of a prophet, you shall receive a prophet. God, there is no way I can leave off this boat without you blessing. Well, lo and behold, the last day at 8 o'clock, we, me and his wife, he was still in the dining room. Y'all know the story. And we stood there and I began to pray. I said, God, the watch is dead. Jesus, the watch is there. When they pull out the number, it came out, they were the winners of their victory watch. A watch that was valued over a thousand dollars. Somebody say this. If he did it before, he can do it again. I told my wife, if I'm going to buy anything on this cruise, I'm going to buy me another victory watch. Y'all ain't going to talk to me.
We hope your life was forever changed and blessed by this life-changing word. Come join Brother Life Deliverance Ministries 222 White Street, Mount Corner, South Carolina in any or all of our services Sunday morning at 11 o'clock a.m. Wednesday at our annual Winning Wednesday services at 7.30 p.m. For more information, call 899-3348. One more time, 899-3348. Until next time, my friend, you be blessed and hold on because any day now, a miracle is going to knock on your front door.